Hey my friend, it's Duke. How do you create your user's login and sign up screen so that your user can create a new account, log into an existing account, authenticate your users into the app? That is the topic that we will discuss in this course. This course, in this course, we're going to build this app. The moment that your user goes into the app for the first time, the login or sign up screen will go up. If the user wants to create a new account, then they will go through the process of uh, taking a profile picture, will enter a name, email, uh, username, password, and create a new account. Then we'll show the new sheet of the app. Now, the second time when your user goes into the app, he or she doesn't have to log in or sign up again. But if they want to log in, they can log into existing accounts. So that is the process we'll go through in this course. We'll use Firebase as our app backend. And if you don't know about Firebase, that's okay. We'll talk everything about backend, front end, how social network app uh, own work in this course. And it is a free course for you. So all you have to do is click the button right down below this page, create a free account, and you can get access to all of the course training, the tutorials, the source code, the resources, the images, the icons, everything in this course that I prepared for you. So all you have to do is click the link on this page and go there, create a free account, and let's get started. This is how the course will be divided into different lessons. Lesson number one, in next lesson, we'll talk about how social network apps and most of the apps now today that you see that has users, has authentication, has all the data, and has a server work. All of those work and how you as a developer can build those apps too. In lesson number two, we'll talk about how to design the login, sign up, welcome screen so that users can authenticate users into that. Lesson number three, we talk about how to integrate Firebase as your app backend and how Firebase works, how the data structure is looks like, how we can structure our data. In lesson number five, we talk about how to create the Firebase reference. In the next one, we talk about how to create the user class so that we can create the user, save the user information, upload profile picture, all of those good stuff. And then finally, we authenticate users, log in, sign up, and use one time sign in in your app so that the next time the user goes to your app, you don't have to ask them to log in and sign up again. And in the final lesson, I share with you where to go from here, where to go from this course to creating real world application like Instagram, Facebook, or Nike e-commerce store. That is everything that we're going to talk about in this course. So I would love to invite you to the course all for free. All you have to do is click the link on this page. Let's get started, create free accounts with us, and let's go into the next lesson where we talk about how most social network apps and most apps, frankly, now today work. And as a developer, how you can create those apps too. So I see you in the next lesson.